Yeah, <laughs> I'll cover you. No All worries. Right, thanks, thanks. <laughs> so Polly Genova is now my bodyguard. Yes, <laughs> because that's true. <laughs> uh, well, like I said, I'm here with the incomparable, the lovely, the returnee. Bali Genova from from Bulgaria. How you doing? Since yeah. the last time we met, I'm I'm very glad to see you. Likewise, likewise. I've yeah. been I've been telling your delegation every single time that I've seen you. Bring that Polly. Bring that Polly. <laughs> so I'm glad my message finally got through. Thank you. Like you're the man. I'm the man. <laughs> no, no, no. I think my boyfriend might have something to say no, no, about no, no. that. I, I, I wanted to say that you're 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 your responsibility. That it's your responsibility it, for me to be here. It's my fault, is what you want to say. <laughs> okay, it's your fault. Okay. <laughs> Well, I just have to ask the big question. Why return and why now? And why is If Love Was a Crime the song for you this year? How is how did all of this come together for you to return this year? The reason, the, the main reason, is the successful Junior Eurovision, mm. which I hosted in Bulgaria. Oh, of course. For a couple of money, months, yes. So um, we worked together uh, perfectly with the Bulgarian National TV, and they suggested that they invite me to do it again. And I was like, okay, let's do that. Cool. Because we deserve that. Uh, after the successful project, we need to continue the line. So what? I think it's it was the best decision. Had you hoped that you would have the chance to return, or is it no, just the stars aligned? Never, never. It was actually um, because I like I, I, I love this contest and I just like it. I really love it. And for me, I've never imagined that this was this could be possible. Mm. So f now I'm like you know dreaming all the time where I am, <laughs> where I'm going to do. I'm you know talking to you. It's 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 a uh, it's 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 my second dream come true. Well, as you mentioned, you did your work with uh, with the Junior Eurovision Song Contest. And you yourself started as a young artist, as a, as a little kid with uh, with Bon Bon. Yeah. What I mean, you could probably give a lot of advice to young artists, but what did you learn from the kids at Junior Eurovision this year? What 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 lessons did you take from them? Oh, to to have fun. You know, the kids uh, are so wise sometimes mm. because they feel uh, things that we forgot. Uh, after a couple of years, we mm -hmm. just forgot it. To have fun, to uh, to know that this actually is a game. This is nothing, uh, you know. This is not dead or life. Mm -hmm. This is not. This is just uh, a very very nice game that we have all have to play it mm -hmm. and enjoy this game. And speaking of games and competition, you were recently on a, a television show where you had to impersonate other celebrities. <laughs> I have to ask yeah. about this. This girl can pull off a surprisingly competent Justin Bieber, of all people. I've seen you in the makeup. It was... It Is was it too late now to say sorry? Seriously. <laughs> I mean, tell me, what was that experience like? I mean, we, we know you as Polly, but what was it like for you to take your talent and your ability and to morph it into somebody else? Oh, Ooh, it was uh, it was hard in the beginning, especially the, 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 the male artists, yeah. you know. You have to feel like a male. For example, before 10 years ago, I had to be um, Ed Sheeran, and I had oh, to, yeah, yeah. And I had to uh, dance with a woman, like I'm a gentleman. Mm -hmm. Such a hard thing, and uh, you know you have to feel like a man. You have to uh, pretend that in your head, then you're on the stage, you're performing, but you are a man, and you have to act like this with a woman. Mm -hmm. Wow, it was not your thing. It was just a different change for you. It, it's yeah. absolutely a big change, but it teached me. I learned a lot from that. Mm. Well, I think it was uh, Gracie Allen uh, who used to say that when she was dancing, she would do everything a man would have to do, only backwards and in heels. So hopefully, it was. It was easier for you to do yeah. it as a man than as a woman because we had to do everything backwards <laughs> and in high heels. Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> so yeah. So uh, I kind of n knew that um, from the both sides. How is it? So it's, huh? It's not easy to be a man. No, it's N not. No, actually. Not that it's easy to be a woman. For the record, it's pretty hard for us too, yeah. ladies. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> So where do you go from here? What's the next step? What's What's the future for Polly Genova? Well. Um, the first step is to have an album in English. All right. So I'm working on that, and um, I I dream to have um, an international career, a real international career, because um, we we the Bulgarians deserve to have a, a successful Bulgarian artist outside of the country, because um, we have a, a lot of talents mm -hmm. uh, in our in Bulgaria, but. Um, because we're small, you know, we don't have the biggest labels are not in Bulgaria. Uh, we don't have a big music industry or a big market. So I think it's time 
the to, world to, to know through, yeah. who is Bulgaria. Yeah, yeah. Well, they have an incredible ambassador this year, as they have in 2011. <laughs> and I hope that this is the start of a fantastic path for you. Where can your new fans, and really your old fans as well, where can they follow you? Where, where's your social media? Here's your time to, to tell oh, the world okay. how, to, how to get in touch with this girl right here. You can find me with all of the social medias, especially on the, my new uh, um, Twitter. All right. <laughs> so you can write me on Facebook. I love Instagram, actually. My favorite is in Instagram nice. because I love taking pictures like a photographer. So I, I'm all over the place. Fabulous. Just write to me. And of course, vote for her. She's what you're number twelve this year, right? Yes, yes. All right, number twelve, semifinal two on, on twelfth of May. We're number twelve. <laughs> Easy to remember. Perfect. <laughs> yeah. And hopefully, twelve will be your lucky number this year. Hopefully, yes. All right, Holly. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh. Oh. And one last thing before we say goodbye. <gasps> Yay! Your mini pops. I'm not sure if you've seen yours for this year. I actually still have Love your mini it. pop from 2011. I still have it. Look how much Whoa, you've grown. Yeah. Look how much you've grown. <laughs> Congratulations. All the best to you, Polly. Thank Mwah. you so much. Yay. Bye, everybody. Right <laughs> Here. Yeah, it will be my lucky charm. Yeah. <laughs>